Okay, let's see here. We got uh, Epic NPC Man Part 20. Let's do it. Adventurer, I need your aid. Creepy kid. My son's lost and I need someone to find him. Oh, no, that's terrible. Yeah, I'm happy to help. Uh, what does he right. look like? Well, he's a beautiful young boy. Takes after his mother, really. Yeah, but what does he look like? Oh, he, he, he's about yay big. Uh, he's got a small, slender frame. He, he's wearing brown pants and a blue tunic. Yes, and he's got a big head. Oh, red hair? Yes! I'll be right back. Oh, quickly, adventurer. He's such a small, young, innocent boy. Ah, there, found you. Don't! Hey, what gives, mister? God, oh, oh God. I'm I'm so sorry. I've I've clearly made a mistake. Um, oh my goodness! You see, I, I'm looking for a young boy, about <laughs> about yay high, with um, well, red curly hair and uh, and a, and a blue tunic. Yeah. Um, I'm looking for that man's son. Papa. <laughs> No, that's definitely not your papa. I'm looking for a little boy, a child. But I am a boy. Oh, you're definitely not a little boy. Not looking like that you are. You're something else. <laughs> but we all look like this. Oh. <laughs> the horror. Oh, adventurer, oh, the horror. you found my boy, Papa. <laughs> Oh, my boy, I love you. I love you, <laughs> This is so disturbing on so many levels, man. <laughs> this is so disturbing on so many levels, man. Like, I, I'm not even able to process this one. Oh, okay. Let's go. Let's go, my boy. Okay. <laughs> Eugene, man, Eugene. Oh, oh no, that's horrible. Come on, man, give up. Who cares? I care, Alan. I care. I've spent a very long time finding the rest of the 599 Bobo seeds, so I'm going to find the last one, all right? Now, the guide online says it should be here, but it's not. Are you sure you haven't got this one already? Are you kidding me? I've spent literally six months finding these collectibles, man. This is the last thing I need to do to 100% the game. So yeah, I'm pretty sure, Alan. I'm pretty sure. Okay, man, chill. Okay, so the guide says start in the clearing. <sighs> right, I'm in the clearing. Take 10 steps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Reach the undergrowth. Where is it? Clearing, 10 steps, undergrowth. I finally did it! Oh. Oh. Yeah, cool, awesome. Right? Yes! Man. Oh. Woo. Now what? Huh? Well, you've uh, <laughs> finished the game? Yeah, look, that's it, man. That's it. 100% of the game. Right now. Cool. Yeah. Woo! Glad to uh, be here with you for that. Right? Pretty big deal. Yeah, big, big deal. Big deal. Big emotions. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Man, it's a lot of time, a lot of time, a lot of effort put into that. So, although I, if I'm being honest, I did expect to feel a little bit more, you know, like a biggest. <laughs> Wait, I'm gonna tell. This is like the classic PVE and PVP conversation. I feel like that should come out of this. You know, Ben Ben being per purely PVE and driven by NPC quest within the within Skycraft, and then perhaps Alan being more like player driven. He's solved it already. It's not that much of a deal to him. You know, it, it, it's it it's a conversation that should be had, but won't happen right now. Sense of accomplishment, maybe. Yeah, I I know what you mean. Now back to the. In fact, sandbox. I'm just now realizing how much pressure I'd put on this moment. You know, like. So much. Six months. A lot of time. A, a lot, lot of work. A lot In a time. video game, I, I guess. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay, man. Feels kind of hollow. Just get back to the MMO. I've really experienced a full of hole. <laughs> it really hasn't. Mm. Wow. And now I'm having a moment. <laughs> oh shit, I think maybe, I don't know, maybe I need to log off. 
touch the grass. experience the real world for a bit or something. Oh no, so scary. So scary. Mm. <laughs> you wanna play some more watch? You yeah, boy! <laughs> Well, it's been an incredible journey, but all journeys must come to an end. This is it. I've made it. This is the final battle. Yes. The last evil lord awaits you down that path. Once you venture down it, your service to Honeywood will be over. I didn't think I'd be able to make it, but I'm ready to face the final, most fearsome dark lord. Go well, old friend. It's truly been a privilege to know you. This has been a long journey. I'm gonna miss you most of all, Greg. Oh, I promised I wouldn't cry. <laughs> oh, here come the waterworks. I didn't think I'd feel this way, but with your grandfather's ring, I know I have the strength to do it. Greg, you've been more than a helper. You've been a true friend. Oh, come here, you. I can confidently say that of all the adventurers I've met, you mean the most to me. Definitely. Bar none. Easily. The most. <laughs> Take care, adventure, and go well! Well, it's been an incredible journey, but all journeys must come to an end. I can't believe it. I mean, I know this is the goal, but I'm actually here at the end. Yes. Last of the Lord awaits you down that path. Who the shit is this? Oh, ah, uh, no, nobody, nobody, no, ah, uh, you, 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 you saved the world. Did you just call me nobody? What, all those adventures we had that meant nothing to you? I helped you catch your sheep for what, for, for fun? No, 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 no. Greg, you cheap, cheap NPC, you, you cheap, cheap trifling NPC, you, how dare you do this? <laughs> no, that, that all meant the world to me. You mean the world to me. You said I was the only adventurer that had the ability to catch your sheep that had run amok. Hang on a second. How many people have helped you catch your sheep that have run amok? Oh, hi. Served uh, more burgers at McDonald's. Uh, look, why does it matter how many adventurers help me catch my sheep that run amok? Huh? Look. You both meant the world to me, both of you. I'm losing both of my best friends, my favorite two adventurers on the same day? What? Like, this is heartbreaking. I'm the victim here. This is a hard day for me. Well, I... I... It's, it's not an easy job to be Greg, you know? Like, imagine, imagine. Yes, it is tough saying goodbye. I didn't realize the strong connection that we all share. Yeah, exactly. So this is hard, but that's life. You, you got to take the bad with the good. And God, we had some good times, you know? Oh my God, is this it? Is this the end? <laughs> oh, yes, this is the end. The, the last evil lord away. <laughs> what the <laughs> shit? <laughs> that's good. That was a good skit. Puppies. Oh my God, not this one again. <gasps> Adventurer. I need your aid. Uh, sure. What do you got for me? My house has been overrun by vermin. Can you please exterminate them? Ah, uh, one of these. Uh, yeah, okay, sure. Accept. My house is just down the path there. But be careful, adventurer. It's a nasty infestation. Yeah, that's all good. I got it. Good luck, adventurer. <laughs> okay, so what are we dealing with here? Rats, spiders, slugs, what kind of foul, wretched... <laughs> Uh... This is horrible, man. This is horrible. I watched this the first time. Last week we released uh, this. I believe it was a compilation as well. And uh, a lot of people in the comments were like, he shouldn't have been able to get out of the house because he never killed the vermin that you're about to see. I'm not going to spoil it. I'll talk about it at the end here. But um... It's a good conversation to be had. We're gonna have it. Uh, mate, I think there's been some kind of uh, confusion here. It's, it's uh... <laughs> yeah. No thanks. You little puppies do not burn, man. Oh. Up, up. The f No, 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 okay, okay, no, cancel quest. Cancel quest. 
No. No, 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 no. Okay. Load safe. Load auto safe? No. No. No, 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 no. No, no. <laughs> You're so metal. You're so metal, man. No. I would like to to let everyone know that I saw the first time I saw this last week, I saw the spiders falling down. Watch, watch, watch. See in the background? See the spiders on the wall right there? Right, right, right. Okay, I'm, I'm guiding you through this. No. No, I don't want to. No. Oh, God. Oh, why? Oh, I hate this game. I'm so sorry. Stop looking at me. I don't have a choice. I tried to leave. <laughs> okay. Here we go. <sighs> you know, <laughs> now a lot of people at this point in the YouTube comments when I watched this, they said, you know, he should not have been able to get out of there because the spiders were the vermin, not the dogs. Now, the interesting thing is on an episode of Epic NPC Man, where Greg has a wife, and it's Brittany. You remember that episode? And they had to update Skycraft, which is the realm that they're in. There's actually a line in there saying that this was a bug. And I just got to say, that is like high-level thinking right there. They're covering their butts because they probably got a lot of that in the comments when they originally made this skit. So it's interesting that they actually, on the developer notes, put that they needed to fix the bug at Eugene's house with vermin that were located in the in the house because of the skit. I think that's like next level thinking. That's why I, I like Viva La Dirt League in that manner too because it's like all very lore related. Ah, adventurer, there you are. Is it done? Yes, it's done. Did you kill them all? You monster. Thank you so much for killing those pesky spiders. They were tormenting my puppies. Spiders? I don't know what I would have done if they hurt my puppies. I love them so. <laughs> yep. Here's your 100 gold adventurer. No, 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 you, you keep that. But Please adventurer, you've done such good. Take the gold. No, 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 I, I, I insist, it's, it's fine. Well, I'll sing your praises around Honeywood. I'd rather you didn't, just, just shh, shh. Thank you, adventurer. Thank you again, hero, for helping me retrieve the Tag season's along. garlic harvest from the bandits of Darkwood. I couldn't have done it without you. <sighs> With these goods returned, the Honeywood Garlic Festival can go off without a hitch. The citizens of Honeywood sure will be grateful, adventurer. Now all I need you to do is return me home so I can start the preparations for the Garlic Festival. Garlic Festival. Now, now all that's required is for you to escort me home so I can start the preparations for the Honeywood Garlic Festival. Where are you going, adventurer? I need you to escort, <laughs> adventurer. Ah! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> adventurer? I mean, it's a nice hat, Adventurer, but I sure wish you would return me home so I can start the preparations. Adventurer? You're not, you're not gonna keep the hat? Ah, I need to go home! Oh, great, we're fishing. We're fishing, we got lots of time for fishing. This is good, awesome. It's not like the Honeywood Garlic Festival needs any garlic. Adventurer, I need you to eat. Ah. <sighs> <laughs> Thank you for coming to my aid, adventurer. You see, I've lost my grandfather's hammer somewhere between here and Schmargenrock. Do you know the way? Ah, uh, Budger, he's already on a quest, a very important quest. <laughs> I do. You do? That's fantastic news. There are many places that I could have lost the hammer on the way to Schmargenrock. To begin with, you will need to investigate Alderkin. It's a heavy train, Budger again? Man. He's already on a quest, right, adventurer? When you get to Alderkeep, you will need to find High Paladin Rondor. He will take you to Wraith. Okay, adventurer, we need to get- <laughs> Do you guys think Alan's arms are really tired this day? <laughs> this garlic to the Honeywood Garlic Festival, it is of the utmost importance. And if you cannot find the hammer in Alderkeep or Wraith, alas, that leaves you with one option. You will have to trudge for miles and miles <laughs> and miles and miles and miles. <laughs> and miles. 
and miles 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 oh i feel bad for him and miles that last look over was the best man and miles and miles through the desert of the deceased do you accept? Okay, Badger, he's not going to accept, okay, because he's already promised to finish this quest. Okay, we're going we're to do that. <laughs> it's right? very bored. I accept. It was very bored related. Thank you, Hiro. Now time is of the essence. You must hurry at once. <laughs> oh, hey, Greg. I didn't see you there. Are you already doing a quest here? Yeah. Ah, uh, you knew that I was. If I, if I had have known it, I definitely wouldn't have sent him on a massive quest. He did this on purpose. <laughs> oh no, that must mean you're gonna have to carry this all the way to. Uh, oh no. Uh, You'll get yours. Good luck, Greg. <laughs> he said. He said you'll get yours. <laughs> right here we are on the outskirts of Wraith. Cutscene versus this is here. Oh no. An orc is attacking that young maiden. <laughs> Leave this to me, Bodger. Hey, ugly. Yeah, you. Why don't you pick on someone your own size? That'll teach him. Milady, are you all right? Yes, thank you, brave adventurer. You're most welcome, but your thanks are unnecessary. I am a member of the Order of the Light, and I'm sworn by honor to protect any citizen in distress. I don't know what I would have done if you didn't come by. Luckily, we need not ponder that awful thought. I am here, and I will do whatever I can to help. Would you escort me home? Sure. I was out foraging yes, when that awful orc attacked, and if my grandmother doesn't see me soon, she'll be worried sick. Well done, Hiro. Let's escort this young maiden back to her home safely. <gasps> More of those awful monsters! You and me, Hiro. Brothers for life! I think I've seen this. <laughs> Protect me! <laughs> Controls. <laughs> Look out, Hero! The orcs are attacking! Come on, how do I? Protect me! Look out, Hero! Here we go, okay, good. <laughs> hey, oh, damn it! Oh, no, not spinning attack! Protect me! Look out, Hero! The orcs are attacking! Oh! I don't know if I've seen that one before. I can't remember, but that is funny, man. This one's called Reputation. Man, I'm so glad you finally decided to give this game a go. I've been playing it for so long. Okay, this is Honeywood. It's like my favorite town in the game. Uh, I'll show you around. Okay, cool. Okay, so uh, first up, here we have Greg the Garlic Farmer. His quests are pretty basic, but he's probably one of my... Oh! Hi! Ah. I have a bucket. Yes, you do. Okay. First lesson, uh, this game has a reputation system, and doing things like that, like stealing, that lowers your reputation and you end up with a bad reputation. And having a bad reputation makes the game harder, like there's some quests you can't even do. I should know, I've spent a long time developing a perfect reputation. I'm sorry, I didn't know. Oh no, no, that's all good. Uh, so, anyway, like I was saying, this is Greg, he's got pretty basic quests, um, but he's actually- oh, ah! <laughs> What the- ah! uh, You're starting to pay! I need to see that again. I need to see that again. Sick quests, um, but he's actually- oh, ah! What the- ah! Ah. You're starting to piss me off. Oh. You both are starting to piss me off a little bit. Come on, man. Okay, ah. I don't know why you would do that when I just told you not to do that. Okay, uh, your reputation just lowered again. If it gets any lower, the guards are just gonna start attacking you and I won't be able to help you. Okay, so in this game, 
your actions have consequences, just like in real life. Yes, exactly, just like I said. Okay, so I have a perfect reputation. If the guards come and attack you, I'm not gonna sacrifice that reputation just to save you, okay? You're gonna get wrecked, and I'm gonna let it happen. Fair enough. Clear? Yeah. Sweet. All right, uh, let's keep going. Okay, and here we have Eugene. He's a little bit annoying, to be honest. <laughs> that was unexpected, actually. I, I don't. I didn't, I didn't think she'd. Wow. What the hell are you doing? Murder is a crime what? punishable by death. Prepare to die. What? Ah! For the peace of the kingdom. Help me. No. Die, murderer. What? Ah! Please. I told you this was going to happen. I'm dying. Please. No, I'm not sacrificing my reputation. It's not happening. For the peace of the kingdom. Please. For the peace of the kingdom. Murderer. Ah! Murderer. <laughs> well, so much for my perfect reputation. <laughs> you there! You there! You there! Murderer! Oh, look! More guards! You there! Yes! Murderer is a crime punishable by that! So you're gonna solo it too? Man, I need to level up. I'm way lagging behind Gathering you. I just need to get some more game time. Actually, can we fast travel to like the depths of Murgos so I can get some XP? Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna pick up my relationship perks from this NPC here. Hey, have you managed to get Greg the Garlic Farmer to full relationship status? Yeah, it's actually not that hard. You just have to give him some like rocks and flowers and stuff. Nice. Oh, my love, <laughs> you have returned. Yep, I'm here. Oh, I missed you so much, but you've finally come back home from your adventuring. Oh, cool. 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 Um, so how's our uh, shop doing? Oh, the shop's actually doing really, really well. I mean, selling lots of goods to adventurers. We've made lots of gold. Awesome. Well done. Hand it over. Absolutely. But before I do, my love, mm. I wrote you a poem. God's sake. <clears throat> Thine eyes shine as brightly Skip. when my heart skips a beat. I know Skip. when you're far away. Skip. And thus I fall mad. Skip. And that's why I love you. Skip. And now, a love song. Skip. My love is like a river. Skip. My heart is open without Skip. I die a thousand days. Skip. I love you so much, I love you, it is true. Skip. Ooh. Skip. <laughs> the entire I hope album. you know how much I love and adore you. Yeah, 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 yeah. So uh, just that gold we were talking about, I will take it. Sure. Oh, uh, uh, before you go, uh, would you like to stick around a while before you carry on adventuring? I would, but... I unfortunately have a thing I have to... <laughs> oh. So you're just going to take the gold and, and go? It is not like that. Well, what's it like then? I thought that you loved me. <laughs> I do. So much. You do? Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, sometimes I think about how we would stand here and, um, and we would talk. And I would give you, I would give you rocks and flowers and stuff. And quest items. She goes on about you all the time. Yeah. Good times. But I'm I'm needed out there in the world. Yeah, I've, I've got to fight the armies of Schmagenrog and save your sheep. Your sheep that have run amok. They do run amok. Let you, you down. What? Let you down so softly, Greg. <laughs> I do understand. God, I love you. Thank you. I love you. Yes. <laughs> I love you. I appreciate that sentiment. I love you. Message received. I love you. I... Damn it, Brett. <clears throat> I... Brett. Love... Make you. Ah, oh, that is such a relief. I was starting to worry you were just using me for my gold and that our relationship was a lie built on a rocky foundation and she's gone. <laughs> Damn it. Kind words. Gross. Oh, this tastes.
town is so gross. Look at this lake, it's horrible. Honeywood is such a shit town, it's such a shithole. Why would anyone want to live here? I would be embarrassed to live in Honeywood, it's such a shithole. The peasants that live here must be so unhappy. Greg! Oh no! Oh no, Greg, no! You, you didn't hear the horrible things I said about Honeywood, did you? Oh, hey, Baradun. Greg, did you hear me muttering over there? I hope you didn't hear the horrible things I said about the Honeywood residents, how they're all peasants and they're gross and they're smelly and I think they're all ugly and you didn't hear that, did you? Oh no, Greg. No, Baradun, I didn't hear it. Oh, Greg, that's such a relief. Oh, goodness. Oh, how long's that been there? <laughs> oh no, let's put that down. Oh no, there we go, it's down now. It can't hurt you anymore, Greg. You know, you're a real piece of work. <laughs> yeah, you know what? You're arrogant and, and big-headed, and quite frankly, you're mean. No, I'm not, Greg. I'm the High Sorcerer. I represent everything that's good and just in this world. Everything that's amazing, everything that's beautiful. Why do you even keep coming back here? What do you mean? If you're so all-powerful and almighty, why do you keep coming back to Honeywood and messing with me? Good question. Well, I... <gasps> There's an adventurer coming. I need to go. Put away! <laughs> ah! Hello, adventurer, and welcome to the town of Honeywood. How can I help you today? Sure, I'll tell you what I can. What would you like to know? Ah! Hi, Sorcerer Baradun. Okay. <clears throat> well, he is the High Sorcerer. So he's very powerful, yes, we are plastic, and science. he's just the... <sighs> he's just the best. We're so lucky to have him. Next question, please. Ah, more Baradun. Okay, I mean, I don't know what you want me to say. I'm a mere garlic farmer, and he's the Shitty, high sorcerer. Sh garlic farmer. He's the high sorcerer. <laughs> he's super powerful, super strong. Tell her about how I fought all the orcs. He defeated an orcish army one time. Tell him more, Greg. He stopped the second war from happening. He pushed back the dragon of Schmargenrog. You know, he's super tough. He's just the best, but he wouldn't- Greg, tell her how humble I am. He wouldn't want me to brag about it because he's so humble. Me, that's me, I'm humble. And that's Baradun. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> ah! Okay, I mean- How beautiful I am, Greg. Baradun, he's good, he's great, he's strong, you know, humble, he defeated things, he pushed things away. That's Baradun! Okay, in a nutshell, now you know! <laughs> Ask yourself next time! <clears throat> Keep your composure. Oh, Greg! Greg! I didn't realize that's how you felt about me. You know I have to say those things. Look, Greg, I... I just want to say I'm sorry. No, he's not. I realize that I've been particularly nasty to you over the past few, I guess, decades. Okay. I want us to have a good friendship, a good relationship. Okay, wow, thanks. <laughs> oh, how long was that now? I had the finger was up again. Oh no, let's get that bad boy down. He doesn't like it. You don't like it, do you, Greg? Cage on it. You can't see it, I can't hurt you. Let's do that, though. Uh, you have it. I don't want it, Baradun. <laughs> Beat down. Hello, adventurer, and welcome to my humble fruit shop. May I interest you in some bananas? They are on special. Bananas? Yeah, how much for uh, five bananas? For you, good hero, two gold. Sweet. Now, they are extra. In dollar. Bit rude. Hello, adventurer, and welcome to my humble little fruit shop. May I interest you in some bananas? Yeah, I'll have five bananas. I hadn't actually finished talking there. They are on special right now, so they're good Skip. for the... How much? Wow, well, this bit, bit rude there. Uh, I guess I could part with my bananas for four gold. Sweet. Now, they are extra ripe. Skip, in dialogue. Everyone's a bit rude today, aren't they? Oh, if we're going this far, I'm going to need carrots for my horse. Oh, yes, actually, uh, could you give me, like, 20? Yep, sweet. Oh, good, you're back. Hello, adventurer, and welcome to my humble little... Skip, 50 carrots. Oh, you are a rude little man, you know that. 
But I'm sure I can rustle up some carrots for you. Let me just check in with my darling wife, Freda. What? No, skip, skip, skip. Just give me carrots. So can I be honest with you for a minute? <laughs> You're actually starting to piss me off here a little bit. Oh my God, what is with NPCs in this town? Just hurry up. I might be just a humble little fruit merchant to you, but I still have some dignity left, God damn it. Why don't you go find your carrots somewhere else? Oh God, I don't have time for this. Either give me carrots or I'm going to take them. You wouldn't, dear. Wouldn't I? Try it. Uh, actually, I wouldn't, I wouldn't do that. Okay, okay, what's going on here with Fred? What's going on here? <laughs> What? Why? I don't care about my reputation. No, I'm not even talking about your reputation. Honestly, these NPCs are way stronger than you think. This guy, the fruit store owner from Honeywood. Seriously? I, I, I guarantee you he's stronger than you think. Dude, I'm level 60. I've fought armies of orcs. I'm pretty sure I can take this bitch. I'm telling you, man, I, I wouldn't do it. Well, now I'm curious. Ah, uh, shit. You attacked me. Yeah. Yeah, how does that feel? <laughs> Die, mother! <laughs> oh shit! Are you with him? No, no, I'm not. I, he's, Are you with? I don't know. I don't know. No, no. You want some fruit? No, no I'm, I'm fine. Thank you. No, it's all good. Fresh nay nay. No, no, that's 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 fine. Just keep walking unless you're hungry. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, adventurers, and welcome to my Fresh shop, nice. the VLDL dot shop. Yeah, you know we got some pretty good swag. Anyway, we are on a journey and we are almost done with this. I can't believe it. We're nearly, we got like seven parts left. We're, we're almost done. And then we can start board and we're going to be like going through every single episode of board. We're going to be all caught up to this channel. We're literally going to watch everything to the point where we're current and we're getting there. It's only, only seven more years, only seven. <laughs>